Today, Avila Beach is an out-of-the-way, sleepy California beach town. However, in the second half of the 19th century, Avila Beach was the busy seaport of San Luis Obispo. Just before the turn of the 21st century, an oil company began cleanup of oil spilled by seeping underground pipes. A quarter mile wide excavation took place. The dirt was replaced from nearby sand dunes. The contaminated soil was taken to the Bakersfield landfill for disposal. Today, the economy of this area relies on tourism. When you drive to Avila Beach, you'll see several farms, most containing apple orchards. Today, the town is rebuilt. It is a beautiful area. Parking is at a premium near the beach. Each time I've been there, it's been laid back, like turning the clock back to a simpler time. The area has three piers. Avila Beach is closed due to safety concerns and it is estimated to cost $12 million to repair. The area is now trying to raise funds to get this done. Cal Poly owns the second pier and is closed to the public. The third pier, the Harford Pier, which is the furthest from Avila Beach, they even let you drive on the pier. They have dry camping, overflow camping, and 10 hookups available on a first-come, first-served basis. For more information, call 805-903-3395 or there's a website, www.portsanluis.com. No temp camping is permitted. Just imagine you have an RV, you have a sailboat, and you can actually park right there by the pier across the street from the ocean and take your sailboat out for a day trip and come back and stay in your RV. How awesome. 